Games you can play with your little one up to one year of age. Games are like the best friends of babies, especially for those who are up to only a year old and pretty much everything they find around them is like a plaything for them. So playing by themselves doesn't really tend to be a problem for babies. But besides that, your baby also tends to play with you and or your partner, which is equally important as not only does that ensure quality time with your little one, but it also helps them to develop overall motor skills. So try out these fun and cute games that you can play with your little one. It's playtime! Build a house this is one of the best activities you could engage in along with your baby. Make a house or fort out of cardboard boxes or use pillows and play with your baby in that. This will keep your little one fully entertained and you will get to spend a lovely time with them too. Peekaboo This classic game wherein you hide your face and reveal it by making funny faces and expressions that crack your baby and makes him laugh so much is not only a fun game to play, but it is also really helpful in developing your child's visual sense of tracking and stimulating their senses. Here's a trick to make the game even better. The next time you play peekaboo, hide behind a large object like a chair or the coffee table or even under a blanket and then you surprise your baby and see how it cracks them up even more than it does normally when you simply hide your face. Building blocks. This is yet another way through which your baby's cognitive growth gets affected positively by increasing their attention span, establishing a pattern of self-reliance and developing motor skills as well. Sit with your baby and play with building blocks by taking turns or make an attempt to build your tar while your child is busy building their own. Help them out if they feel stuck and sometimes let them do whatever it is that they are doing. Patty Cake this clapping game is also a great classic game to play with your little beanie. Clap your hands with your baby and make them clap their own hands too as you repeat Patty Cake, Patty Cake, Baker's Man, Bake Me a Cake as fast as you can. This game is also like a little exercise that leads to better hand-eye coordination and the development of verbal skills along with finer motor skills. Counting games. Play counting games with your baby but only for fun because your little one is a bit too little to be able to understand how it works. Whether it is one to buckle my shoe or counting beats, let your baby have a fun time and who knows, maybe playing these games regularly might just end up teaching him a thing or two as well. Finger games. They are really helpful for the development of the hand and eye coordination as well as motor skills. A daily dose of its bitsy spider and twinkle twinkle little star with lots of hand and finger movements is just the way to get along with your baby. Add voices or exclaim phrases like yay, very good, hooray for a bit of a special effect and make facial expressions too if you want. Some other fun finger games involve baby shark when you make a hand gesture of a shark or fish by horizontally placing one hand on top of the other and clapping, climbing caterpillar, bumblebees, etc. Learning games. Babies prefer fun over learning, but why not mix both together? The best learning game is one wherein your baby is able to have fun along with being able to learn as well. Take both of your baby's hands into yours and touch their tiny little fingers on your eyes, nose, mouth, etc. as you say the name of each body part out loud. Then do the same with your baby's body parts in the mirror. You could also use her big fluffy teddy bear or favorite dolls for this game and name each body part as you point it out on the toy. The more you play this game regularly, the faster your baby is going to learn about all these body parts. Games involving movement. Play these games to enhance your baby's bodily movement and coherence. Walk them back and forth while singing his favorite rhyme. Lift them up and gently soar them back and forth while saying, we goes the airplane, but make sure that they are ready and comfortable with that. Play pop goes the weasel and other such games and watch your baby have fun and giggle to no end. Try incorporating your baby's favorite toys in as many games as possible to make playtime even more fun. You could also use things from your kitchen like a spoon, a glass, a bowl, etc. and make music in different sounds and see how well your baby responds to that. Similarly, you could also include other objects from daily life in your playtime and name them out loud every time you play with them. And the next time, have your little one fetch that object. What a great way to learn! 
But I missed everything. It is really important to make sure that you don't enforce anything on your cute little button because that will only make things difficult for both you and your baby. Give them ample time to rest too. And even while playing, if they are giving you signs of getting tired, then let them rest and be by themselves for a while. Or if they are not showing much interest and you think they are getting bored, change the game or add your own twists and special effects to it. And get creative. Let your baby take an active part while playing and take turns in games like building blocks, learning games, counting games, etc. Have a great playtime. That's all from us today. We want you to know that your voice is important to us. So please leave a comment below. If you are new here, then click the bell icon for notifications of our new videos and subscribe to our channel.